Learn and play online. In today's video, we are going to learn about koalas. Koalas are one of the best known native animals of Australia. They can be found through much of Queensland, New South Wales, Victoria and some parts of South Australia. Koalas have a unique and distinct appearance. They have large fluffy ears, a black spoon-shaped nose, they have five digits on their paws. If you look closely on their front paws, they have two opposable digits which act like thumbs. This gives them the ability to climb trees with ease. You can see that they have rough pads on the other side of their paws, which also helps them to grip onto tree trunks and branches. And check out just how sharp those claws are. Their fur can vary from a grey to brown colour with white fur on the chest. Whilst they are commonly referred to as koala bears, they are actually not bears at all. In fact, they belong to a special type of mammal group called marsupials. This means that not only are koalas warm-blooded animals that give birth to live babies, but they also have pouches where their babies grow and develop. Baby koalas are called joeys, and once a joey is born, it immediately finds its way up to its mother's pouch using its strong sense of smell and touch. Joeys rely on their sense of smell and touch as they are born blind and earless. Here's a fun fact. When a joey is born, it is only about 2 centimeters long and looks just like a pink jelly bean. Once the newborn joey reaches its mother's pouch, it will stay there for about 7 months as it continues to develop. In this time, the joey will be fed milk produced by its mother, as well as a special substance called pap. The pap comes from the mother's intestines, which means that the joey is eating its mother's droppings. As unpleasant as that may sound, it is an essential part of a joey's diet because it contains bacteria that baby koalas need to have in its own intestines. This is so that when it becomes an adult koala, it can digest eucalyptus leaves as well. You might still be wondering why it's important for joeys to eat pap. This is because eucalyptus leaves are actually extremely poisonous to most animals. And by eating pap, koalas develop bacteria in their stomach from a young age that helps break down the fibers and toxic oils that eucalyptus leaves contain. After growing and developing in the pouch for up to seven months, a joey would then stay with its mother on her back for around another six months. In this time, the joey will learn how to grasp leaves and climb trees. By the time the joey reaches around a year old, it can live on its own. When koalas reach the adult stage, depending on the species, they can range from 60 to 85 centimeters in length, or 2 to 3 feet. And they can weigh between 8 to 13 kilograms, or 15 to 29 pounds. Koalas live in open forests and woodlands which are dominated by eucalyptus trees. Although they can eat up to a kilogram of leaves in a day, they are actually very fussy eaters, as they would only eat the best leaves on the trees they occupy. Although there are over 600 types of eucalyptus trees in Australia, koalas will limit themselves to no more than two or three species within their area to feed on. As their diet requires a lot of energy to digest, koalas spend most of their day sleeping. In fact, koalas can sleep anywhere between 18 to 22 hours a day sleeping. As their diet is made up of eucalyptus leaves, which are also known as gum leaves, koalas rarely have to drink water, as they get most or all of their moisture from the gum leaves. Because of this, they would only need to drink water on extremely hot days or during a drought. The name koala itself is an Aboriginal word which translates to no water. Unfortunately, their population is on the decline. In fact, the Australian government listed koalas as an endangered species in February in 2022. There are many factors which have contributed to this, including car accidents and disease. But the major threat comes from a loss of habitat. Koalas have lost around 80% of their original habitat since European settlement in Australia due to land clearing, drought and bushfires. In order to help save our koalas, efforts must be made to restore and protect their habitats. Koalas are iconic Australian animals and their conservation is key to ensuring they don't become an extinct species. Thanks for watching! Please remember to subscribe for more videos.